Greetings and salutations, my name is GW608, and today I am playing Star Maid. And we are back on the battleship. I have done just a little bit of work. Notably, I put the uh, escape pods back. And I've been working a little on getting shape in the front. Because I I just want some something a little different. Anyway, that is not what we're doing today. Today we are going to be working on the rest of the bridge. Not a lot of the rest of the bridge, but I do want um, something else back here. Uh, mostly a... Uh, let's see here. Let's do a holy T. Load that up. No, I don't want a T. I want a four-way. Um, 2.2 four-way. We're going to do it like this. We're going to try to line her up there. That even lined up properly. All right. No, 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 no. I wanted a, I want a straight piece, don't I? Yeah, I want a straight piece. Flip floppy today, I know. Uh, let's see here, and I'd also like some bathroom tubes. Okay, and which way is the door? That way is the door. Uh, so let's. Fire up some symmetry and let's pop down a bathroom. Actually, let's pop down two bathrooms. Stop that. Go away. Okay. Let's turn off. No, 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 no. They want. They need to be on first, dummy. And then let's grab um door. Two T half doors. Let's put the two T. Uh, two is the slot on my my um, hot bar. T brings up this wheel, and let's do it. So just uh, one button controls one set of doors. That would be nice. Ooh, that's There we go. Ah, now there are two uh, breach bathrooms. And yeah, we need a wall or something here. Ooh, ooh, what are you doing? I'm gonna be jumping back and forth between um symmetry for just a moment. So set that up so my wall will have symmetry. Or my yeah, when I have wall it'll be pretty on the floor. And I would like a door. This was split door. I, think I like the split doors the best. They're my favorite. All right. It looks like there's clearance for that. Okay. Now I'm going to need to find door. Door. I have uh, doors blueprinted. Uh, I don't remember if that was A or B. It was A. To make to make life easier. Mm -hmm. Open and close, and let's see here. This is code red, so I need that one linked here. So it's open, but when we go into code red, or not code red, when we go into lockdown, my door closes and I can't open it. All right. No. No. Well, that's not what I want. I don't want that for this. I want this room to be open. Any yeah, I want this room to be open anytime. There you go. Oh no, no, no. But yeah. Do I want? Hold on, let me think. Because this is going to be the bridge. And I don't want to get lo the captain locked in a room back here. <coughs> Excuse me. On the bridge level. Huh. Alright, so let's see here. Let's uh put an activator and a... 
one of these. I'm going to say lock and load. So I have a lock here, but not necessarily. Oh, wrong way. In fact, we're going to call this eight. Ooh, a door lock. Mm hmm. So that goes into this, this goes into that. Okay. Anything else tie into that properly? Yes. So since I don't remember exactly what I did, we're going to tie this into a brand new knot. To the brand new knot there. All right. So that should be able to open and close. If I lock the door, it should not open. There we go. All right. So this is going to be a, a, a conference room type deal, a ready room. Uh, yeah, like a ready room. Uh, so, or war room or something of that nature. Let's drop our, there we go. Drop our blast doors. Oh, question about the blast door. Did that come all the way up flush? It did. Okay. And run some symmetry in. Yeah, it got crazy with that. All right, I'll work with that later. Anyway. What was I doing? Oh, door. Not door. Um, room. So we have this, and we're going to do... Um, I have... Here it is. I have templates for this. Let's see, but they are not quite there. One, two, three, four, five. Let's paste it. That is a door template or a large window. And let's do a room wall. I oh, have to go this way. And a corner. Load. Uh, yeah, okay, I was, I was trying to line it up with that, but that's part of the door. All right. No, this room doesn't need to be that big. That's probably better. Let's load a window door. Two, three. Hmm. Would this be... Yeah, that's fine. And let's see. Let's grab us another corner. Load and paste. And small load and spin. All right. And somehow that is off center. How did that become off centered? It's five wide. How can it be not? That's not five wide. What did I do? Okay. Alright, what have I done? These are all five wide. So let's stick these interior wall uh, here. Three. I'll go four. Those doors. Peace. There, load them. And paste. And go here. 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 And we get a corner. Load in. Paste. Okay, that worked. Wonder what happened. Huh. Oh well. Let's grab a room and not an interior of uh, wall. Let's unpaste. Let's do a five by five by five and remove the modes. Let's turn off the remove mode, repaste, and 
bunker down. All right. Make sure I didn't drop an extra room piece somewhere. And there. Um, okay, that's interesting. But easily solved. All right. So let's take care of our of our windows here. Um, how am I gonna do this? Hmm. My brain is thinking. We're not gonna have those pieces there. All right. So let's grab a black crystal armor. It goes six. And they're, they're going to be heavy windows. They don't be so wide. They need to be so long. Oh, not that long. Okay. Full block windows. And there we go. We have a, a ready room. Uh, it's a huge, uh, conference room. We're going to call it a conference room. Uh, the bridge conference room. So let's see here. What does a conference room need? Probably need some sort of presentation area. We'll give it that much presentation. Oh, no, what have you done? Oh, I didn't set the, uh, symmetry. With that much of a conference area. And let's see here. How about we... We'll give it nearly as much tallness to this desk, uh, desk table. Uh, it's... It's 11? 11, alright. No, 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 no. This room is enormous. We need a bigger... We can afford a bigger table than that. There we go. And let's do a number like this, and a number like that. And let's wedge her up. All right, so now we have a nice large table. And where are the rated ingots? The Zercanter, I believe. Let's see, uh, every other one. And, of course, the captain's chair. Captain's chair needs to look more important than everyone else's because it is. Hmm. All right. Do I really want... No, that might get in the way of presentations up here, so we're gonna, just going to give him a fancy back. Oh, they all need fancy backs. Well, they all need fancy sides, too, but that might not happen. All right. So we have us a conference room on the bridge that you can lock yourself in. And uh, it tells you whether or not it's locked, so it's nice. All right. Now, I do want for this room to have its own blast shield windows like uh like the bridge except i want them to be able to control them so we'll put, we'll put all the controls here uh do this and see here and we're gonna go last oh blast windows and wire this up with the um, button. And we will do that probably next time. Let's set that up. And also red alert type stuff and lights. Yeah, let's go ahead and set this as lights. And there we go. All right. Lights are on. <laughs> we will wire all these controls up. And I 
think that's going to do it for today. Anywho, I have been JW608. This has been Star Made LDU Cats. Later.